morning everyone. Uh, just out on the beach. Uh, going to bring Equinox out for a hunt. Um, I have no clue about this machine. First time for knocking her on. Um, very forced hold. Only here about two minutes. Yeah, it's a little copper coin. Um, I think it's a farden. I think it's like one of those wren fardens. I think it's very, it's very thick. It's it's not a decimal penny. It's not a half penny. I think it's a farden. But anyway, just come out with there. Just literally knocked the machine on the Equinox 600. Um. We're going to keep going and try and learn this machine a little bit. Uh, I think I some I have it in beach mode one, and I think I got it. I'm not too sure. I got the noise cancellation done on it. Anyway, look, I'm going to have this cup of coffee, and let's go and try and learn a bit about this. And see what we can find. Okay, so a little Irish five, and a British. 5p out of the one hole. I'm literally not here. I must be here about 15 minutes. This thing is just super sensitive. Just alert you to the small stuff. I thought I had this place whacked with the razor. Looks like I'm only getting started. Right, on to the next one. Okay, uh, I just scraped the back a little bit. I've uh, Hmm. I'll try that. It's located with the pinpointer, but somewhere here. Oh, pinpointer on, my help. Let's see what it is. I'm not used to the VDI no more, so. Could be anything, I suppose. Ugh, what's that stuck to that? Something here. Coin. <laughs> no way. Ah, look at that. Ew, 2p coin. Jesus Christ. How was I missed that? A stinking tube and so. 1970. Ugh, right, on to the next one. Look at that. <laughs> Don't mind that. Look at that. Look at that for a musket ball. What are you doing? Don't like them. Just don't like them, but we obviously missed that with the razor. Right, let's go and get a couple of coins. Well, guys, round one. Stopped having a cigarette because I haven't stopped digging since I got here. Super impressed with that machine. It's a howler, absolute howler. Um, the usual, the ring pulls. Uh, a few little bits of scrap there. A um, couple of coins. Uh, that one I thought was a farthing. Pretty sure it is because it's too small to be a five cent. And it's too small to be a decimal penny. It's definitely a farthing. It's a fard, maybe a wren fard. This little piece here, I think it was, um, kind of see it there. I think there used to be a pin on that at one stage, sorry. Kind of see there where the pin would go in. Maybe it's the back off of a brooch or something like that. Pretty sure the pin would have swung up, up and down on this end. And Kind of catched underneath there, so a nice little interesting point. Anyway, oh yeah, and the muscle ball. <laughs> yeah, we're going to keep going and uh, see what else we can get. Well, we're having a great day anyway, so beats walking. Right, guys, I think I can see something in the hole there. Yeah, um, it's giving me. I have it picked back. It's giving me. 2021. Uh, I think I can see a coin down there. I think so. Looks like 
50p shape. Let's dig it out together and see. Let's have a look together. Oh, come on. It feels very thin. Oh, come on. Boy, it's a coin. Uh, I'd imagine it's a big old pound coin by the look of it. I'm just going to check the hole and see if there's anything else in there. Sort of might be all right. I thought it might have been a pound coin. Uh, I think it's a Britannia penny. Here he is. Can you, you know, yeah, I can see George on the side of that. Yeah, big old Britannia penny. Right, will we? Well, there I'll draw you. Nineteen. Anyway, that's what that was given. Cool, right. Let's try and get a few more coins. Right, guys, that's a wrap for me. Uh, I only gave it about an hour or so. Uh, this machine, Jesus, have you digging all day? Uh, tell you one thing, the pinpoint on, on it is just so accurate. Just brings you straight to the target. Uh, am I pleased with this? Yeah, well placed. Right, uh, finds uh, yeah, a good few coins over. Uh, this little thing, my god, the depth that was down, like a little river or something. The depth I dug for it, I was finding it hard, even with the pinpoint, or it was hit and miss. But anyway, yeah, a couple of coins, a few half pennies. As I said, a little farden, I think. Truppants. Well worn and battered. Two uh, Georgian pennies. Uh, English five and Irish five. Big old musket ball. Right, so, uh, yeah, nothing more to be said. Uh, gonna go home, have a bit of lunch, and uh, we could out tomorrow with Alan. Tomorrow or Sunday, maybe. Good to see. Anyway, thanks for watching.